Welcome to Barcelona. This is Spain's second largest city with 1.6 million residents. It's the capital of Catalonia and a cosmopolitan city filled with artistic and architectural treasures. Let's go check it out. One of the most famous artists born in Barcelona is John Moreau, and we visit his works at the Fundacio Moreau, which is located on the picturesque hilltop of Mount Juic. The museum features 14,000 works dedicated to the Spanish artist. Museo de Juan Miro, Fundacio de Juan Miro. Juan Miro. John Moreau was born in Barcelona and created surrealist works that were playful and whimsical. This is one of his smaller paintings. This one looks like a watermelon. Some of the mixed media pieces. The Fundacio Juan Miro is one of the most fundamental uh, architectural pieces within the last 50 years in Barcelona. This is what the museum looks like. This is a model. There's atriums in there. Very modern. Right now, I'm inside an art installation. These are flowers. Wow, this is so trippy. Oh my god. What does it smell like? You smell the flowers? Right outside of Fondacio Miro, you'll find Jardin de Larabal, which is situated on a steep area of Mont Juic and features beautiful waterfalls, elegant gardens, and exquisite views of the city. We're walking through the park and look at these trees. Everything's in bloom. It's early April here. And behind me, you can see all of the terracotta roofs. I'm in Barcelona right now and we're crossing through these elevated skywalks to go to Plaza. This is the Caixa Forum built out of an old factory. So this is my third time to Barcelona. The first time was on a cruise. It was August and it was so hot. The second time, I just went to the airport. So third time, we're seeing the city. This is a model of the Art Nouveau architecture. Now, time to check into our hotel. Time for a hotel tour. This is the Hotel Hilton Diagonal Mar, and it's situated very close to the ocean. In fact, you can see some of the waves over there. And then there's ocean and city views from a lot of the rooms. Look at that city. Welcome to Barcelona. <laughs> Now we 
head to one of the famous boulevards in Barcelona, Paseo de Gracia, to check out some of the highlights of architecture. All right, we're walking down Paseo de Gracia. Architecture everywhere. I'll see you later. The details on this. The Palau de Musica Catalana is a famous concert hall built by architect Luis Domenech between 1905 and 1908. It's done in Catalan modernista style. You can either view the building from the outside, take a tour of the architecture, or you can watch a concert. One of the best ways to visit the Palau de Musica is by watching a concert. Let's get a preview of the acoustics. The interior is crowned by a natural light skylight done in stained glass. Now we walk north to check out another architectural surprise in Barcelona. This time, a hospital, but not just any hospital. This is the hospital done by the same architect. We are at... Hospital de San Pau. Who's the architect? Luis Dominic. Cool little cafe here. Look at the murals. This is a World Heritage Site. The Barcelona architecture scene is much more than Gaudí. Here you can see the works of Luis Dominic, a key architect in Modernisme, the Catalan Art Nouveau. Hospital de San Paul was built between 1901 and 1930 and done in Catalan modernista style. It was a fully functioning hospital until 2009 when the hospital next door was built. For an admission fee, you can tour the architecture of San Paul. I'm literally surrounded by cool architecture. Look at this, everywhere. so whimsical here. It looks like a fantasy world. I love Art Nouveau. Around 9 o'clock, it's time to eat in Barcelona. We hit up one of the local Catalan tapas bars where we tried the Catalan cuisine, including pan con tomate. Grilled prawns We hope that you enjoyed this video of Barcelona. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe because coming up next, Ibiza.